Good morning, traders. This is Options Tender here. So sorry about last night. I forgot to do the actual market wrap, the the review, the update. So we put out all those names yesterday. They're still valid. Um, we're going to go through the market in real detail right now here for you to get us ready for this day. And it, it's worked out perfect because we have a lot of shenanigans happening right now before the shed, the fed meeting so let's get it down to it the uh if you like this information hit the like button subscribe for us so we can get this information out spread the word and spread the wealth we have es on the monthly we are working on wave five right here we're getting towards the end of the month so you see our candle is a nice healthy bullish candle we push to the upside looks like we're turning into a doji um healthy Looking good on the MACD. Let's head over to the weekly. Weekly. One, two, three, four. Also working on wave five. Still over the trend line. Um, over the 8MA. We're getting real tight in here. Let's see if we can't get a... Uh, Let's see if we can fit a line here just getting super tight if if that's a line we um the resistance we go with we'll maintain a look at that curving over here the macd kind of sideways action um let's look over to the daily daily trend is our friend we are working on minute wave one two three and we believe we believe we are almost done with the three we want to push up one more time to validate this count um and this is where look at this bar <laughs> that's our shenanigans right there we're breaking through the 8ma we'll see where we close that's the important part is where this candle closes um if we go underneath this candle here that is 37.88 and a half that invalidates the count that means that count is invalidated and we have to rework our count we'll look at it on a lower time frame you see we're curling down on the macd we're getting close here guys getting real close to uh, uh that pullback we've been talking about just not shorts today we'll have to find out after the fed meeting all right on the hourly Let's get real close here. Here we have um, the f wave three and a wave three, and we have the A, B, C correction. And yesterday we we're kind of thinking, okay, this is a one, two, and working on three, and that th that wave three was just so short. And I'm just thinking about this, you know, uh, for a while, and I'm like, wow, you know, I thought there was a five count in here. And so I really dug in, went to the five minute. And what do we get? Lo and behold, we have a one, two, one, two, three, four, five, four, five. So that puts us a full wave count. Let me translate that for you. All right. That means that we had a full five wave count. For right here which means that's just the beginning of wave one or the end of wave one and that makes this wave two and me personally i think that's a wonderful thing because that allows us a whole nother wave five to the upside before we make our our move um our, our bigger correction to the downside so again what invalidates this count one two if this two goes underneath this level here, it's no longer a two. Okay, we'll put a we'll put a um a support line there uh, after I get done with this video. But it, looking hideous on the MACD, heading to the downside. But we do expect at least it can come all the way down a full hundred percent retracement, bounce off of this, and head to the upside. But uh, as of right now. This is our count one, two, and then we're looking for um, a impulsive three 
to head up, okay? All right, so all of our trades that are um, that were mentioned on last night's video, they're, they're still valid. You know, they're gonna start off, they're gonna open probably gapping down or at least uh, um, pulling back a little bit, like Fubo. I know that Fubo was, um, let's see if we can pull that up here. I'll just show you an idea of what's happening. We were up on Fubo in the after hours, and you see the market's trying to settle out. So it's still up. We're still up um, almost at like three and a half points. So nothing to worry about the strong names. Let the market pull back. This is actually a great entry point for a spy call. Now, the shenanigans, this is a game of probabilities, right? Probability has it that our count is correct and that we're going to pull up. Um, and we're going to start. Uh, so we'll look at some uh, Friday spy calls or maybe even tqqq because it's all about <laughs> it's all about the uh uh big tech right now so uh those are some options for you some trade ideas and let's just uh let's put on a retracement here just to see where we're at with this we're going to put on a retracement from the bottom of wave one to the top of wave one and it just lines up perfectly with that 3804 we're you know we're bending right through this uh 78.6 percent but let's see where we go from there and then if it comes all the way down to the 100 percent, that's fine that's just a, another entry point we'll uh we'll have to look at it um see what's happening during the trading day so everybody good luck trading today if you have any questions about this information um, let me know. Put it in the comment area. Uh, I'm also on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook if you want to uh, message me on any of those. Um, anything else? I think that's it. Okay. Good luck trading. Thanks for joining Options Tenor. Hit the like button. <laughs> All right. We'll talk to you after the bell.